It seems like every day we learn something new about gender. Although it's traditionally been thought of as a fixed biological characteristic, there are plenty of living creatures that challenge that notion. The ability to change gender or to multiple genders at the same time is not exactly a rare phenomenon, especially when it comes to fish. On the water, inhabitants change sex for a number of reasons. In a number of species, it is not initially determined what sex the fry will be. Belonging is late during the development of future fish from eggs, when most of the fry develop into males. This phenomenon occurs due to the work of the aromatase enzyme, which regulates the action of sex hormones. At high temperatures, the androgen-destroying substance becomes less active, which leads to an increase in the concentration of male hormones. Light has a similar effect. In aquarium conditions, due to a bright lamp, the liquid heats up. Under optimal conditions, it is believed that more females appear capable of laying eggs to increase the population. If the external environment is unfavorable, the fry will experience stress, due to which androgens will prevail over female hormones. In a number of coral fish, females can turn into males as they mature. A similar phenomenon is observed in parrotfish. At birth, all individuals are female. First, they spawn several times, after which they find their own section of the reef. Then the structure of the reproductive system changes. In schooling fish, the phenomenon is noted when an imbalance occurs. For example, clownfish live in groups, each of which consists of the main pair and the young male surrounding it. When the main male dies, his place is taken by the strongest of the others. If the female dies, her partner will change sex. Scientists observed this process on the example of a group of females from which all males were evicted. RNA sequencing and epigenetics analysis were used to track the processes. Due to the influence of unfavorable external factors, loss of the ability to reproduce, the fish begins to experience stress. The body begins to release hormones that destroy the reproductive system. At the same time, Substances begin to be produced under the influence of which male genital organs are formed. At the same time, appearance and behavior change. The gonad. The gonad of an individual is completely rebuilt in the process of sex change. First, the genes responsible for the production of female sex hormones are turned off. Only after this are the systems that produce androgens activated. In this video, we are going to look at some different fish that change gender from male to female or vice versa. It's estimated that about 2% of fish species possess hermaphroditic features. The nature and function of gender in these species is diverse and varies from species to species. Clownfish are sequential hermaphrodites, meaning they first develop into males and then into females once they mature. Clownfish also follow a dominance hierarchy in which a powerful, aggressive female is at the top. If she dies, the largest male clownfish changes into a female and becomes the next alpha. This fish is referred to as Kobudai in Japan and is the one of the largest species of wrasse. They are native to the Western Pacific Ocean and live in rocky reef habitats. The Kobudai changes from female to male once it reaches a particular size and age. The mangrove rivulus lives along the coast of Florida, Mexico, Central and South America. They are hermaphrodites that can self-fertilize by producing both sperm and eggs, although there are some males that also exist. There are certain types of salmon that are synchronous hermaphrodites and possess ovaries and testes. Unlike the mangrove rivulus, they cannot self-fertilize, but they will swap roles in regards to which partner lays the eggs and which one fertilizes them. This type of sea bass lives in Atlantic waters, from the coast of Maine all the way down to Florida. They start life off as females and then change into males once they reach about 2 to 5 years of age. The broadbark goby is reef-dwelling fish native to the Indian Ocean. They have the rare ability to change sex both ways, from female to male and vice versa. Damsel fishes are known for their bright colors and patterns. They live in tropical areas, in rocky reef reefs. Females 
also have the ability to change into males when the need arises. This eel is a type of moray eel that's found in the Indo-Pacific Ocean, off the coast of places such as East Africa, Australia and Southern Japan. Every ribbon eel is born a male that has the potential to change into a female later in life. The black porchy is a type of sea brem found in the waters around Japan. It's a fast swimmer and an aggressive predator. Like the ribbon eel, they are born male and then change into females at around 3 years of age. If you liked the video, please give it a like, share, subscribe to the channel and click the notification bell. Please follow me also on Facebook and Instagram, that would help me a lot. Thank you very much and see you next time.